Hollywood star Kevin Spacey strenuously denies allegations he sexually assaulted three men in Britain, a court has heard. Spacey, 62, emerged through a scrum of photographers and fans to make the appearance at Westminster Magistrates Court in central London. The double Oscar-winning American actor was granted unconditional bail. It means he can return home to the U.S. before his next court appearance. Patrick Gibbs, defending, said, Mr. Spacey strenuously denies any and all criminality in this case. He needs to answer these charges if he is to proceed with his life. Spacey was not asked to enter pleas to the five charges, four counts of sexual assault and one count of causing a person to engage in sexual activity without consent. Stood in the dock in a blue suit and dark tie, the actor confirmed his full name as Kevin Spacey Fowler, his address at a flat in Waterloo, London, and his date of birth. The court heard he lives in the U.S., where he has family and a dog, and needs to be in America for auditions. After being granted unconditional bail, Spacey smiled and nodded at Deputy Chief Magistrate Dan Ikram. Spacey occasionally glanced towards the packed press bench and public gallery during the 28-minute hearing. The charges relate to alleged offences in London in 2005 against a man who is now in his 40s, in London in 2008 against a man now in his 30s, and in Gloucestershire in 2013 against a man now in his 30s. Get all the biggest showbiz news straight to your inbox. Sign up for the free Mirror Showbiz Newsletter. Spacey was artistic director of the Old Vic Theatre in London during these years. The Crown Prosecution Service authorized the charges against him last month, but he could only be formally charged once he travelled to the UK this week. After asking if he could address the defendant as Mr Spacey, Mr Ikram said, You have cooperated, I am old with authorities in New York and have voluntarily attended these proceedings today. Spacey, who won Oscars for 1995 film The Usual Suspects and 1999's Immersion Beauty, said last month, I will voluntarily appear in the UK as soon as can be arranged and defend myself against these charges, which I am confident will prove my innocence. He is now due to appear at Southwark Crown Court, South East London, in July. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at webcelebsatmirror.co.uk or call us direct at 0207 29